Oh, hi! Today I'm going to be teaching you 10 things you don't know about me. No one ever taught me what a urinal was, so in first grade I took a big sh inside one. Oops! Or should I say, poops! <laughs> My grandma hated, 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 hated getting her photos taken. So I've ever only had one picture with my grandma, and that's because she called me a baby, so she put me on her lap, fed me a water bottle, and that's literally the only picture I ever got before she passed away. My dad's in jail, and has been in jail since I was five. It's okay though, because I still get to visit him. I'm not quite sure what he did, but it was definitely something bad. And yes, I'm six foot, and him and my mom are both 5'4", so I kind of tower over them. Never had a broken bone before, but I have had a fractured bone. Back in the day, my mom was not okay with me being gay, and I was on the way out of the door going to see my boyfriend, and she was just not okay with it. So she grabbed my thumb, pulled it all the way backward, and I fractured my thumb. We had to go to the hospital. I was very upset because I didn't get to see my boyfriend, and my thumb was fractured. Which reminds me, one time she was stomping on my hand and it caused permanent damage. I'm not sure why, but when I go like this, these fingers kind of like to go inward. These kind of like to go like this. I think it's supposed to look like a normal hand, but for some reason, when I close my hand, these like to go this way and these like to go normal. I used to co-own a club in Hollywood called Club Wannabe. They played hits from the 90s and today, and it was so, 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 so much fun. If you guys have ever seen the movie Party Monster, we used to have club kid nights where people would dress all crazy. And one of the original club kids, James St. James, growing up, he was one of my idols because he gets to express himself in ways never before expressed. He was all crazy. Oh my God, he was literally goals when I was younger. And he came to my club night and I was, I, I wanted to cry. I was like fangirling. I was like, is this real life? Like, I'm having a club kid night and James St. James is at my club. I believe in law of attraction. If you guys have ever seen The Secret, if not, go check it out on Netflix right now or buy the book. It is so good. Or any of the law of attraction books by Abraham Hicks because I've read so many of them and I've gone to actually quite a few seminars from Abraham Hicks and they are so amazing and it's such a great concept that I love it. Stay positive, stay happy, you control your future. Of course, I've had Botox. No, not in my face. Is that what you were thinking? You were thinking I had Botox on my face? No. So a while ago on our boyfriend channel, Nick got Botox type two in his armpits right here. So basically Botox type two disables you from sweating in your armpits. And I thought it was the most amazing thing in the world. So like a month ago, I decided to get my armpits Botoxed. Sweat free bitches! When I go to sleep, <laughs> I love covers. I love to be nice and warm and comfy and cuddly, but I hate, 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 hate when my feet are hot. So I sleep on my side with my feet out of the covers, out of the comforter, in the free air, because I don't like when my feet are nice and toasty, but I love when my body is toasty. So I wrap myself in my blankie, but I leave my feet a little dangling out of the side. When I was younger, I despised hair. I did not like it. Even before I hit puberty, I had peach fuzz, like the clear peach fuzz, and I used to shave it off so I'm nice and smooth. I swear I was born to be a lesbian, but I hated hair everywhere. So one day I was looking at my tongue and they have these little, the, the tasters, they look like mini teeny little hair follicles. So I thought, hmm, well I don't like hair and I shave my hair everywhere else, so why don't I shave my tongue? So I literally shaved my tongue and it bled forever. And now I have like a part of my tongue that <laughs> doesn't grow hair. Look, watch. <laughs> okay, okay, so now you know 10 things that you didn't know about me before, or maybe you because you're a super fan or something. I'm not gonna be doing the prize wheel this week because I am redesigning my channel, creating a new intro, creating a new graphic, and I'm trying to figure it all out, so please bear with me here. But don't forget to subscribe and like this video because every time you don't subscribe, a gay baby turns straight. <gasps> See you guys next Sunday. Bye.